Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is the Acer Swift 3, which is a uh, $499 starting price notebook, measures about 18 millimeters thick, and it uh, weighs about 2.2 kilograms. Uh, it's available with a 14 inch or 15.6 inch display, and it uh, has Core i3 through Core i7 KB Lake U series processors, full HD display, up to eight gigabytes of RAM, up to two terabytes of hard drive storage, or up to 512 gigabytes of SATA SSD storage, and up to 10 hours of battery life. It's uh, not quite as compact as the Swift 3, and it's not fan or the Swift 1, and it's not fanless like the Swift 1, but it's the uh, other thin and light series that Acer's introducing, in addition to the Switch, uh, Swift 1 and last year's Swift 7, which we had already seen. We've got a fingerprint sensor, nice wide full-size touchpad, uh, a little bit larger because there's more room on the keyboard for that. In terms of ports, we've got USB and an SD card slot. You can see them better here on this model that is silver instead of blue. And HDMI, more USB ports, USB Type-C headset and power. Uh, this model does have a glossy display. It does not appear to be a touchscreen display. Uh, but whereas the Swift 1, the cheaper model, has um, a matte screen, this has glossy. Uh, this also is not fanless, but it does have more powerful processor options, including optional NVIDIA GeForce graphics. So that's a quick look at the new uh, Acer Swift 3 series coming this summer for about $499 starting price and uh, going up from there depending on what you want to configure it with. The entry-level model will probably have 4 gigabytes of RAM, a Core i3 processor, and um, maybe 128 gigabytes of solid state or 500 gigabytes of hard drive storage for uh, for an entry-level model. But again, it's available with up to a Core i7, uh, up to 512 gigabytes or 2 terabytes of SSD or hard drive storage and optional NVIDIA graphics and comes in a couple of different color options, including what we see here, which would be blue and silver. This is Brad Linder with Lilliputing.